Welcome, and thank you for joining me today. I invite you to take a few moments to make sure that you're comfortable, to make sure that you will not be disturbed, turn all distractions off, and remember to never listen to this while you are driving or operating any form of machinery. And let's begin by taking in a nice, big, deep breath. And as you exhale, just letting your eyes close down. Begin now to bring your awareness to your breath for a few moments. Just using your breath to bring stillness to your body, quiet to your mind. Breathing in and out your nose. Making sure that that exhale is just a little bit longer than the inhale. Letting go slowly. And on your exhales now, Begin to imagine your whole body becoming loose and limp with every breath that you exhale. Imagine a balloon with all of its air flowing out. And let your body become loose and limp like that balloon. you just observe from within your mind how well your body responds to your thoughts. Breathing in and letting go completely as you exhale. And as you focus on your breath, I'd like to remind you that all hypnosis is self-hypnosis. You are always in complete control. There is no power on earth that can stop you from entering into a state of hypnosis. It is a natural state, a natural ability that we all have. And during our session today, Whenever you hear me say the words deeper and deeper down, that is a signal for you to let go just a little bit more. And all that it means is you are drifting deeper and deeper down into an awareness of yourself. So let go of your breathing now. Forget all about your breathing. We're going to take a moment to become grounded and centered. So I want you to imagine that you're standing in the middle of an empty room now. And think about your energy expanding all the way out to the wall in front of you. And now pull the energy back, back to your body. The wall on the right now. Let your energy flow all the way to the wall on the right. And now you bring it back, back to your body. Wall behind you now. Bring your energy back, back to your body. The wall on the left, all the way to the wall on the left. And now you 
bring it back, back to your body, down to the floor below your feet. And I want you to imagine the energy flowing up through the soles of your feet, through your ankles, your calves, your knees and your legs, all the way up to the center of your body. Now let that energy flow all the way up through your upper body, your shoulders, your neck, through your head, all the way up to the ceiling above you. Just guide the energy back down, down through the top of your head, down through your chest, the center of your body. You bring your awareness back to your breath for a few moments, just observing how slow, deep and rhythmic your breathing has become. I'd like you to bring your awareness to your feet for a few moments now. Think of your feet wonderfully relaxed, your ankles, your calves. The muscles throughout your upper legs, all the way up to your waist and your hips. Let all of the muscles just let go. Begin to feel your legs getting heavier and heavier, or lighter and lighter. Whatever you feel is perfectly natural for you today. But just think about your lower body, so incredibly relaxed, so that from your waist down to the soles of your feet you are so deeply relaxed. And now guide that feeling. Think about that feeling flowing up through the lower back, the lower abdominal area, up through the rib cage, your back all the way to the shoulder. Think about all the muscles in the shoulders, throughout the shoulder blades, letting go like elastic bands being released. And feel your body just letting go, sinking into the surface below it. Begin now to think about this feeling of relaxation flowing down into your arms, past the elbows, forearms, the wrists, right out the palms of the hands, tips of the fingers. Your arms are so incredibly relaxed, it feels as though the bones are even relaxed. Loose and limp. And you just observe from within your mind how they feel. If they feel heavy, if they feel light, it doesn't matter. You just observe without judgment. Now think about that feeling flowing up through the neck, letting all of the muscles in the neck go like elastic bands being released. All tension is released. 
As you allow your body, you guide your body into a wonderful deep state of body sleep. Let that feeling flow up through your chin, your jaw, the back of your head, through your ears, your nose, your cheeks, your eyes. Feel your eyelids letting go completely, becoming so heavy as though they were glued shut, fused shut, locked shut. You just observe how well your body responds to your thoughts. You let this feeling flow all the way out the top of your head now. Your breathing is slow, deep, and rhythmic. And it feels good to let go. You allow it to be a pleasure today to turn the whole world off for a little while and to go within. And as you are wonderfully relaxed, I want you to think for a moment. I want you to observe your body for a moment. And I want you to think about a dial a dial that goes from zero to ten. Zero being deep body sleep, ten being tense and uncomfortable. And I want you to think about where on that dial your body is right now. How close to zero is it right now? And if it's already at zero, then that's absolutely wonderful. But if it's not, in a moment we're going to bring it right down to zero. Just allowing your body to enter a wonderful deep state of body sleep. While your mind stays focused on the sound of my voice. This happens every night when you go to bed. Your body it falls asleep before your mind. And that's all you're doing here. So just notice what number comes to you easily and effortlessly. Whatever the first number is, that's where it is. Just go with that. There's no need to overthink it. Now in a moment, I'm going to count from three to zero. And I'm going to snap my fingers like this. When you hear me snap my fingers, if your dial isn't already at zero, I want you to bring it right down to zero and just allow your body to enter an incredible deep state of body sleep. Just want it to happen, and it will happen. Three. Two. One. Zero, deep body sleep, feeling your body drifting deeper and deeper, every breath that you exhale, you drift deeper and deeper down, deeper and deeper down, letting go completely. I want you to think for a moment. I invite you to think for a moment about a beautiful, peaceful place. A place where you feel completely safe and undisturbed. Maybe a place that you've been before or a place that you'd like to be. Just allow yourself to be there for a few moments. Drifting down deeper and deeper into this wonderful, safe, peaceful place. And 
And as you are relaxing in this wonderful, peaceful place, I want you to think for a few moments. I want you to think for a few moments where it is that your mind goes in those mundane moments of your day. Where does your mind go when you're doing your everyday tasks? What are you thinking about when you're taking a shower, driving to work, doing things around your home or at work that you do every day? Where does your mind automatically go? Do you think about how grateful you are? How happy you are? Are you thinking good, healthy, positive thoughts? Or in those moments, do you automatically begin to think about things that make you sad, angry, frustrated? Do you think about times when you didn't have enough or when someone didn't do what you wanted them to do or treat you the way that you wanted to be treated? Where does your mind go in these moments? And what emotion do these thoughts bring out in you? How do these thoughts make you feel? You see, the job of your subconscious mind is to keep you at your normal state, not your natural. But what has become your normal state? And it's in these moments we can really tell what our default setting is, what our emotional default setting is in our subconscious mind. Because we're not trying to think about anything. It's just coming to us effortlessly. So what I want you to do today is I want you to think about a dial again. But this time I want you to think about a dial that points to all of the different human emotions. So many different feelings, anger, the victim state, procrastination, giving up, happiness, joy, love, compassion, all of these different feelings that we have. It doesn't matter if you don't see it perfectly clearly. I just want you to think about this dial for a moment and I want you to think, where is your dial set? What is your default setting? Where does your subconscious mind just automatically go in those moments? And just take note for a moment without judgment. Now forget all about the dial. Just set it aside for a moment. Bring your mind back to that beautiful, peaceful place that you have chosen today. That beautiful, peaceful place that you have chosen. And imagine that you are laying down, relaxing, letting go deeper and deeper, deeper and deeper down, floating and drifting. The deepest part of your mind stays focused on the sound of my voice. And just bring your awareness to your breath for a few more moments. 
Notice your breathing slow, deep, and rhythmic. And I invite you now to begin to think about gratitude. Think about being grateful for what you have in your life. Allow yourself to feel gratitude in this moment. The things, the people you are grateful for in your life. Allow yourself to be there right now feeling this gratitude. Let go of everything else. And just allow yourself to feel this gratitude. Let it flow through every cell of your body. Feel how good this gratitude feels. Now I want you to think about joy and happiness. Think about a time recently or a long time ago that you were really, really happy, feeling joyful. Just be there in your mind right now as though you were reliving it today. Happiness joy. Feel how good it feels to feel so happy and joyful, giddy. The laughter that comes with that happiness and that joy. Let yourself smile. And now I want you to think about inspiration. What or who inspires you? Allow yourself to feel the inspiration. What inspires you? What motivates you? Who do you admire? What is it that inspires you and gets you really thinking and feeling and excited about something? Allow yourself to feel the inspiration. And now, I want you to think about compassion. Think about somebody suffering and wanting to help them. Allow yourself in this moment 
to experience compassion, to feel compassion. Be there in your mind. Allow that compassion to flow through your body, through every cell of your body. And now, I invite you to think about love, what it feels like to love someone, that wonderful feeling of love. Think about somebody that you love, that loves you. Allow yourself to experience love right now by thinking about it. Let the love flow all through you, through every cell. Feel how good it feels to feel love, how natural it feels, how right it feels, how easy it is to feel love. And now I invite you to feel peace, silence between the thoughts, peace. Let everything go. Just be still for a moment. Just imagine joining that space. between thoughts. Allow yourself to float and drift in this peaceful feeling. And now, I want you to think about that dial again. And I want you to think about where you want this default setting to be pointed. And I want you to change your default setting now if you want to. Where do you want your default setting for your emotions to be set to? Just take a moment to think about that. Do you want your automatic default setting be set to peace, love, inspiration, compassion, joy, gratitude, whatever you like. But take a moment to change that setting now in your mind. Go back to that dial and change it now. And what you're going to do as you go about your day in the days to come, whenever you catch yourself in those moments to throughout your day, those mundane moments where you're doing the everyday tasks and you catch yourself 
thinking about things that you know you don't want to be thinking about, things that you shouldn't be thinking about, things that you don't need to be thinking about. When you catch yourself having thoughts that you know are not going to allow you to feel your very best, I want you to think about that dial. And I want you to change it to the setting that you want it to be set to. And very soon, very soon, this will become your automatic default setting, your emotional default setting deep in your subconscious mind. You have the ability and the power to change this. And this doesn't mean that you are not going to feel the emotions that you're meant to feel throughout your day. Our emotions are a very valuable tool and a part of being human. This is simply changing that default setting changing that emotional default setting where you automatically go in those moments, those mundane moments throughout your day. And as you change the setting, you will find yourself feeling better, feeling happier, feeling more joyful, feeling more lovable, feeling more compassion, inspiration and peace, whatever you choose. So just take a few more moments now to think about your dial, where you want it to be set, making sure that it's set where you want it to be. And think again about that peaceful place that you chose today that beautiful, peaceful place. And just allow yourself to drift in this peaceful place for a few moments. And when you hear the sound of my voice again, I'm gonna count from one to five. And when I reach five, you'll open your eyes, take a nice deep breath, stretch, and say the words out loud for me, wide awake. One, begin now to bring your awareness back to the room that you are in, the sounds around you, the surface under your body. Two, bring your awareness back to your body. Begin to awaken your body, your hands, your feet, your arms, your legs, the muscles around your eyes. Three, feeling good in every way, physically invigorated, mentally clear, aware and alert emotionally calm and at peace. Four, feeling ready to open your eyes, ready to stretch, ready to get on with your day or your evening, feeling absolutely wonderful. And five, open your eyes. Say the words, wide awake.